It's a big, beautiful trailer, and there's a dog. Goodness gracious, this thing's got to be 30 feet, I mean, I guess, at least. And they finally opened it up. Yeah. But it says. 1952 Vagabond. Okay, that makes sense. Look at those curtains. Those are beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, we're gonna have to interview these people. My name is Stacy. And where are you from, Stacy? We're from Salem, Oregon. We have a 1952 Vagabond. We bought it in 2018. Oh goodness. And it became our 2020 can't go anywhere, <laughs> stay at home project. <laughs> so was it in this condition when you got it? It was totally gutted. Oh goodness, so yeah. you did all of this yourself? My husband and I, yes. We did woodwork, we did plumbing, we did all the electrical. Uh, we haven't painted yet, that's our next project, but we just bought in a little bowls and we have a Another trailer for my parents to do, so it's kind of got pushed to the back burner, but we're out enjoying it while we can. So is this your first vintage trailer? No, it's, uh, we have six. Six? Ooh. Wow. Oh boy, they're, they're an obsession, collecting them. right? Yeah. For sure, for sure. You collect them like, like the kitties on your on your sweater. Yeah, so, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I've heard multiple comments about the, the primer on the outside, so that's, that's temporary. It is temporary, okay. although we have gone back and forth because yeah. people have been like, hey, you know, it looks it, really cool. It does, right? yeah. Right? We've heard people yeah. even say that it, it, it gives it a really cool look yeah, yeah 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 thank you and the, the color actually is not going to be too much different than what it is mm -hmm. it'll be uh, about the same color just shiny yeah and then the top of it will be a, a cream <gasps> oh that's yeah. going to be very classy Ooh, looking yes, I love she that. loves cream black yeah. and, and uh, like gold. cream with things is very nice awesome mm -hmm. so it was gutted how many fixtures like were the fixtures in it or did you have to source everything we ah. there was some fixtures in there um, there's only two original uh, light fixtures and we actually found another identical vagabond that somebody was selling and um, it was in horrible condition probably not repairable so we asked them if we can just buy it and get it and we went down and bought everything that we could and uh, all the hinges and doors and windows and all that kind of stuff all the and accessories yeah yeah Wonderful. and just cleaned them up and put them on it so we so you guys have, you guys have had experience before with like warping the plywood for the ceiling and all of that yeah there's a couple of pieces in here that we left original because they were because they were salvageable mm -hmm. but other than that everything's brand new so wow. just so you had to steam it yourself and do the whole bit yeah and there's two different kinds of wood in here so we had to cherry stain some of it to get the hue to match the other mm -hmm. one mm -hmm. yeah thank you that's incredible and did you do the like all of the the curtains and everything as well the curtains were actually vintage curtains out of somebody's house that I found on marketplace and so I <laughs> took those panels what? and cut them into what we needed yeah aren't those great finds yeah like, don't throw these away I want them so, yeah, yeah. As I was looking I'm like this definitely looks like vintage fabric that's in yeah. That's incredible. Yeah. Um, was the layout the same? Did you design it on the original layout or did you customize? It was similar, but we did, um, we morphed it a little bit because we put some modern touches in there. We have a, a 14 year old son, and so we wanted to make sure that it fit him as well and that he kind of got some of his modern stuff in there. And so you'll see the TV and the Murphy bed and that kind of thing is um, for, for his. So, so have you had any of the shenanigans like uh, Lucy in the long, long trailer? Uh, <laughs> not yet. <laughs> <laughs> so how long did it take from start to finish? Um, it was just about a year, just working wow. on the weekends and after work and stuff like that. But it was it was a nice um, distraction. Thank you you. want to give us a walkthrough? Absolutely, you're welcome yeah. to yeah. come in. Well, have you guys go I'll first, go first yeah. <laughs> I'm excited to see the inside. <laughs> Oh my gosh. It is the color is it just glows. And some of them are pretty dark, they're still pretty, but this is light enough that it I think it let the light like kind of reflects Thank off you. of it. Yeah, it's it really warm nice. but it's not too dark. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I definitely wow. love this color. Oh, it's these incredible. built in shelves. Yep. And those were original. We had to replace some of the pieces. Um that it was still in the trailer when we got it. Um That's good. but we were able to, to make some of the extra pieces, pieces there to put it back together. Speaking of the long, long trailer. <laughs> <laughs> that's amazing. And so, yes, that's a flat screen TV, obviously, but we made it look kind of retro-y so it didn't yes. Yes, stick out like a sore thumb. Well, it, you guys nailed the look on that. Yeah. Thank you. It's something I've seen done before, but that's 
probably the best I've ever seen it done. Oh, thank you. So, so you must have got the knobs off another TV set. eBay. Ooh, bucket of knobs. Yeah. <laughs> bucket of knobs. I like to, that's what we need, Lola. Bucket, of, bucket of knobs. I think, I think you already married a knob. So. Oh, no. 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 Um, is this a Murphy bed? So this is the Murphy bed. Okay. It wow. It just like folds down. Yep. Oh and so it's fully gosh. made now. And then yeah. these pins come out and we move the little table over there. And then this just it's lays down. latches and yep. there it goes. And this there's a shelf a that matches this in here so that he can lay his device and that kind of stuff and then yeah. made sure there was electrical outlets and stuff for him. Pretty so. genius way to have that extra sleeping never you know, bed without it taking up a big space. Yeah, so. Thank yeah. you. And then this is a click clack also that um, can convert to a bed so if we have... Oh so that's actually space. a bed as well. Mm -hmm. It looks just like a regular couch. Yes. And um, you guys have just nailed all it with all of, the all of great your vintage accessories. Yeah. yeah. Accessories. Oh, I love it. And you have the, oh yes, you have the fold up because I was looking up these chairs outside because yes. we have four for our trailer and nice. I was like, oh, um, but yeah, so she, you've been collecting quite a while probably. Um, a little many. bit, yeah. Um, we actually found another whole entire set of these the other day, which is how we got that up. Yeah. <laughs> um, but we had four of these and they, we made it kind of custom in here to where we can just tuck wow. them in there and not have to take things. The sheer in amount of closet yeah. space in yeah. this thing too. Yeah. This, I love this. <laughs> it's a lot of shoes in here. Yeah. <laughs> so is that the original refrigerator? Um, this was not the original refrigerator. It had an international harvester in here, but the um, handle was broken mm -hmm. and we weren't able to source the handle. And so we bought a whole new refrigerator. We took it out and we got it all cleaned up. Everything was great. Ran outside, we stuck it in here, it wouldn't run. Mm -hmm. So we actually went to Home Depot because I was tired of it. <laughs> and we got a regular apartment fridge. Okay. And built and we that over that over Yes, that it. looks yeah. amazing. Yeah. It was a little shorter here, but my yeah. husband was able to fabricate that to where it fit the door, so. Good job, husband. Wow. <laughs> Thank you. Well, he's very, very talented. It yeah. looks like you got full heater, air conditioner, the whole bit. Yeah, modern. That's right. <laughs> you gotta have, <laughs> gotta have that. Yeah. Come on, it's 2022. We want, we want the old-fashioned look, because but we, we want the modern convenience. We for die sure. for two months out of the year in the heat, yes. and then if you want to go camping, Outside of that, you need the heat. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. You guys have a Dixie. Yeah. Yes, the Dixie. Dixie's still here and it works. We cook breakfast and do oh our thing on that. And then there's the double sinks and lots of storage. And I lots love that countertop. It looks, it looks original, but well, I know it's, it's not. The, yeah, it's nice and shiny. Wow. Um, so did, did he do all of these cabinets as well? Um, we had found part of these out of the other Vagabond and mm -hmm. the doors as well and the hinges, all of that stuff and just kind of pieced it together. But yeah, he refinished everything. And wow, and so you had to piece it. multiple ones together. Uh, love that. This looks like you have so, this could be like an apartment. It looks yeah. like it has so much space to In, in New things. York, this would be like 4000 yeah. a month. <laughs> yeah. I really like this. Thank the you. little coffee station or bar. You just like area. the panels and don't like it. I just right? I like the little yeah, coffee station bar. Kind of <laughs> necessary for life. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and there's like a full kind of little pantry kind of thing here. Oh, so we yeah. have tons and tons of storage. Okay. If you're yes, if you have a yeah. if you have a vintage trailer, it's always camping rules. Always have coffee and booze yeah, available. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Oh, so we're going all the way back here and they got a bedroom and everything. This oh, is yes. just a, insane. Oh yeah, the little twin bed. This is, because I've been in the ones with the, the bed in the back, but they seem to slant down faster mm -hmm. maybe. This one has a lot of headroom, which is nice. Or maybe just certain styles, but it feels very open. <laughs> and it's got the, the old uh, Desi and Lucy beds. Yes. Separate, mm -hmm. but equal. Yes. <laughs> Actually, mine's not equal. Mine's three inches shorter. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. To accommodate the door, yeah. but I'm also. Oh, shorter, that's right. So There's a door fine. back here as well. There is. That's amazing. This is the little dresser. Yep, they got a little door there. into their bedroom. Your bedroom alone is the same size as some of these uh, tin cans over there. Yeah. <laughs> is there a bathroom? There is Can a bathroom. Can we take right a little yep. peek? Okay, we're gonna take a peek. Like, I don't want to fix all of this. I don't want to break it. Oh gosh, I even love oh, the toilet roll. That's amazing. It's so cute. And the toilet roll, a rolly uh, Bluetooth. I should have turned that on, but uh, it actually will play music. Oh, how fun! <laughs> wow. And it's got the little shower, the little wet dry bath. That is nuts. I know. I gotta take a peek too. 
We could just sell our house, babe, and get one of these. Yeah, take it on the road. This is adorable, you guys. And the bathroom, did, was it all pretty much together? Or did you have to? Um, actually, it had a hole in the floor. The toilet <laughs> <laughs> had fallen through the floor on the way home in the middle of the field. Oh, yeah. no. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. So it was basically a complete rebuild. Oh, boy. Oh, my gosh. And then another closet. You yes. really could. Because I, I come to these events in like with heels and dresses a lot of times. So closet space is necessary. For sure. I didn't realize you, you two match. You, oh, I don't even plan that out. No. <laughs> we always coordinate with the people we're interviewing. Nice, <laughs> nice. I have shot many vintage trailers, but I've never had one with this much room where I could just run the camera in here like a house. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I was saying. Like, sometimes it feels, even if they're pretty open, there's like little pockets where it gets kind of cramped. And this wow. one felt open through the whole thing. So what is your favorite thing about this trailer? I actually love, well, I love everything about it because we, we were really, really thoughtful in the things that we did because, you know, when you have a child also, too, that's going to be in here with you, I wanted to make sure that it was comfortable for all of us, but I love sitting up here that there's enough room for friends to come in and visit with us and have coffee or cocktails or whatever, and I just love it, and the people you meet in doing this. Yeah. Oh my gosh, they're the trailer people are the best people. Absolutely the best because we see a lot of tiki people and they are also the best people mm -hmm. but trailer people are really the best people <laughs> <laughs> what i'm hearing is if if someone has a year of spare time in their life of every single day and every single night and your they talent. too can and the skills yes they too can have one of these they too can have one of these and a full-time job that's right yeah, <laughs> to pay yeah. for it yeah, yeah. That's, yeah we know how that works <laughs> yeah, yeah well thank you so much thank i appreciate you. your time today thank you Bossa Nova.